All right, Liz, thank you. Well, over the weekend, at least three people were shot and killed in Baltimore City. Several other people were also hurt. There's now been 25 murders in the first 24 days of 2022, and city police have not reported any arrests in any of them. WMR2 News' Aaron McPherson is live at BPD headquarters right now with the latest on those investigations. Aaron. Good morning, Megan and Christian. Well, over the weekend, eight people were shot, four on Saturday, four on Sunday, and three of those people did die. It all started on 2.30 Saturday morning. A 31-year-old woman was shot in the 100th block of Water Street and survived. Before the morning ended, police found a 30-year-old man shot in his car, police and he, where he later died and that was around 1130. A couple hours later, a 29 year old man was shot and killed in his car in the 2900 block of Allendale Road. Shortly after that, officers found a man in the 2500 block of Pop Powhatan Avenue. He was rushed to the hospital where he later died. Now, three people gunned down the same day. Safe Streets Baltimore came together to honor one of their own. Deshaun McGreer was shot and killed in a quadruple shooting last Wednesday, doing what he dedicated his life to reducing the violence and promoting peace. Safe Streets organizers talked about how they need to do more to get a handle on the violence in the city. And Mayor Brandon Scott went to Saturday's event to show his support and stressed everyone needs to step up to help. It's bigger than one individual. It's bigger than one system. It's bigger than one person. Yes, sir. It's bigger than one community. Yes, sir. If we're going to cure ourselves of this disease that's been plaguing Baltimore longer than breath's been coming out of my body, we have to get deeper into action and everyone has to look in the mirror at themselves and say what I'm going to do. Now on Sunday, there were a few shootings and none of those were deadly. A 29 year old was shot around 2.30 in the morning. A 24 year old woman and a 17 year old boy shot around 2.30 in the afternoon. And last night around 7.30, a 23 year old was shot. Now there were no arrests reported in any of these cases. So if you have any information, you're asked to call police. And you can always remain anonymous at number 1-866-7-LOCKUP. Live here at BPT headquarters, Aaron McPherson, WMAR 2 News.